Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. So today is actually my birthday. It is July 11th, so I'm about to go get my free Starbucks drink. And I'm very excited because I actually asked you guys over on Instagram to give me suggestions on what to get because I really just want to try something new. My go-to is a venti brown sugar oat milk shaken espresso. I've mentioned that before. I absolutely love that drink. So I want to switch it up and get something else. Um, um, so I got a bunch of good suggestions, but I'm going with a suggestion from a girl named Zayla So shout out to you Zayla. Thank you so much for your suggestion And she said to get an iced cinnamon dolce latte no whip oat milk and add salted caramel cold foam I guess so that's what I am going to get and also obviously I have Mello with me so we're gonna do a full vlog with Mello because his birthday is in 10 days so this video you might not see until a while after my birthday just because I want to get Mello celebration in this vlog as well and his birthday is not until July 21st so you guys will probably see it around then Mello are you excited to go to Starbucks all right guys we've made it to Starbucks I am next up to order I do have my little birthday pop-up on the Starbucks app so I'm very excited to get my free drink and try something new also Mello is very excited FYI if he looks a little um, grimy it's because he gets groomed in four days and usually <laughs> right before he gets groomed he looks a hot mess because whenever he drinks water and eats his food his face just gets so dirty and I try to clean it with like a little wipe but it doesn't help all that much hi could I get the venti cinnamon dolce iced latte and can I get that with oat milk a venti iced cinnamon dolce latte yes with oat milk yes ma'am and then can I get salted caramel cold foam on top salted caramel cold foam on top already anything else and that doesn't come with whip does it I'm sorry um I don't know if that comes with whip, but I don't want any whip on it. No whip? Alrighty, anything else? And then, can I also get a pup cup and that'll be it. Alrighty. Um, alright, and then a pup cup? Yes. That'll be $8.75, thank uh, you. Okay, thank you. $8.75, girl, you did good. So I wanted... <laughs> okay. I wanted a really expensive drink because it's free and usually when I use my points I always try to get the most expensive drink <laughs> that I can think of that way You know I'm getting my money's well not my money's worth because I'm not paying for it But I'm getting my points worth you know which I actually have a free drink with points too But we're gonna use the birthday reward. I know Mello is gonna be turned up once he gets his pup cup Like he's gonna be super turned. Bobby look <gasps> You see what's in here? You just want a coffee? Do you smell the coffee? Hey, um, I have a birthday drink today. I don't know how you need to get that. Sorry, say that one more time. Um, venti mocha. Are you excited? Oh, thank you. I'll give that to you once we park. Okay. Thank you. You too. Okay, Mello. Oh my gosh, you guys, this looks so super good. Ooh, I'm excited. Zayla, girl, you came through. Yes, you did. Okay, so let me get parked and then we will give Mello his little pup cup and then I'm gonna try this drink. Okay, so I'm gonna try my drink first. Oh, oh that's really good. Zayla, girl, oh my goodness. You know how to whip up the Starbucks drinks. That is amazing. Okay, then we're gonna give Mello his little pup cup. Come here. What's going on? Okay, so this drink is so delicious. I would highly recommend this to you guys well this was a success and Mello is I mean as you can see he tore through <laughs> this pup cup absolutely tore through it and now his little beard is all wet with little uh what is this whipped cream <laughs> 
He's got whipped cream on over his face. It's funny because whenever I give him ice cream at home, because I'll give him um, this doggy ice cream. It's made for dogs, but it will get all in his beard and I'll try to dry it out or I'll try to dry it off as much as I can, but it will still be stuck in there and he will go and he'll like run around the living room and go onto the couch and the rug and he'll like dig his face into the rug and try to get it off and it is just so hilarious. I'm going to go and walk Mellow. I might get some footage from our walk, but I don't know how interesting that will be. Oh, Mellow, don't worry, I'm gonna get that off you. But yeah, I guess I'll see you guys once I pick up the camera again. Well, hello guys. So I'm back from walking Mellow. As you can see, he is panting very thirsty I try to like in the past I've tried to get him to drink out of those little travel bowls you can buy the little rubber poppable travel bowls to put water in but he will not drink out of them I do not know why but he will only drink out of his bowl at home that is the only bowl he will drink water out of he won't touch the little travel bowl so I just stopped bringing them because um, I've tried it multiple I actually just tried it on the 4th of July yeah, he would not drink out of it. So he just likes to be thirsty until we get home, which, you know, that's on him. That's not on me. I try to give him water. He didn't want to walk for too long, so we just did a quick little walk, so I didn't really film it. It was maybe like a 30 minute walk, which is pretty decent. But as you can see, he's going crazy. So today's agenda for the rest of the day, I would like to go to Kendra Scott because someone on Instagram messaged me and said you can get 50% off of an item at Kendra Scott on your birthday. And I absolutely love Kendra Scott. I actually have um, an entire bracelet stack from Kendra Scott. This bracelet stack right here is all from Kendra Scott. So I really love their jewelry. So I kind of want to go there and see if I can get that jewelry piece for 50% off for my birthday. I might get like a ring or something. I don't think I'm going to get another bracelet, but I kind of want to go there. And then tonight, Gabe and I are going to see Thor, which I am so excited about. I think it's going to be really good. I really liked the first Thor movie. And then I also liked the third one, which was Ragnarok. The second movie was like honestly not that good. It was okay. I mean, I liked it just because it's Marvel, but it definitely wasn't the best. But I really liked the last one, Ragnarok. So I think this one is going to be really good as well. And I feel like Marvel just gets better and better over time. So I am super excited to go see Thor. I think I'm going to go home and clean. I need to clean. I'm also trying to do a, a big closet purge. I'm so sorry if Mello's panting is like <laughs> a little obnoxious. Poor baby. He's thirsty, I think. But I'm doing a huge closet purge right now and I'm clearing out my entire closet. I'm going to take everything to Plato's closet. I would try and post my clothes on Depop, but honestly, I just feel like going to Plato's closet is way more easier. I mean, I can literally just bring all the clothes to Plato's closet and collect a hundred to two hundred dollars as opposed to taking pictures of each item listing it on depop and then waiting for it to sell you know i just feel like plato's closet is easier faster and whatever doesn't sell at plato's closet i just take it to goodwill and donate it so you know that's that's the, oh my gosh a lemonade stand oh so cute little kids at the lemonade stand oh i should go back i don't have cash on me though they probably only take cash because it's like outside of a neighborhood that is so cool though i've not seen a lemonade stand in so long okay anyways you guys i'm gonna stop rambling on i will check in with you guys if i do end up going to kendra scott i really should because 50 percent off the jewelry piece that is a very good deal but yeah see you guys soon so it is now about a little over a week later and it is time to open up some gifts for myself as well as Mello. so Mello has his little birthday hat on but it's definitely not gonna last a while so enjoy it while you can because it's gonna fall off but yeah it is currently july 20th so it's actually a day before Mello's birthday so we're gonna unbox Mello's gift first but i do have two gifts for myself from myself um i did a little bit of a splurge just to i don't know just to treat myself you know so we're gonna go ahead and open up Mello's gift which is this one back here <gasps> Mello. This is your gift. This is your gift, Bobby. 
Okay, you ready, puppy? This is your bag. This is your bag. Oh, this is your birthday bag. What's in here? What's in here? Okay, <laughs> so here's the inside of the bag. So we got some goodies in there. Nada, you ready? Are you ready? Come here. Come here, first gift. Oh, oh my goodness. Wow, Bubby. Look. Oh, is that a balloon? Is that a balloon, baby? Yes, it is. Hold on, let mommy take everything off. Wow, look. And does it squeak? <laughs> and it's squeaky. Oh my goodness, Mello, do you love it? Oh, I think he loves it. I think he does. Okay, Mello, come get next Prezi. Come on. We got another one. What's this? Oh my goodness. Wow, it's a birthday cake. Wow. Oh my goodness. And this is your favorite material. Mello loves this like crinkly material. Oh, you love it, don't you? Hold on, let mommy get all the plastics out. I don't want you choking on nothing. Hold on. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Wow. Okay, go ahead, take it. Go ahead. Okay, let's see what else we got. We got another squeaker. <laughs> okay, so Mello actually has a toy just like this one. It's just different colors, and it's one of his favorite toys ever. So I knew he was going to like this one. He loves the little hamburgers. <gasps> Look, the puppy. <laughs> oh, go get it. Bring it back. Mello, come get next present. Okay, so we got a present in here. Go ahead and unwrap it. Come here, unwrap it. <gasps> Mello, look. <gasps> Oh my goodness, mommy really spoiled you with this. Okay, so this is like a frosted bone that says happy birthday. It says it is an apple cinnamon flavor dog treat. This thing is huge. Like, this is really huge. This is going to last Mello a long time. I'm going to have to like break it up. Mello, <gasps> look. It's sweet. It's a little sweet treat for you. Okay, I'll give that to you later, okay? And then we have, I think, one more gift. One more gift, Mello. No, two more gifts. <gasps> what is that? Is that a busy bone? <laughs> is that a busy bone? He loves these busy bones. I've never gotten one this big for him, but it says that it's a small. As you can see, it says small on there, and it has, like, a little guy on there biting it. So I think it should be fine. It'll probably last him a while. <gasps> do you like that? Uh, do you like that? I know you do. Okay, I'll open up that for you <laughs> once we're done. Okay, and last thing, Mello loves these. Oh, he's all us. Mello loves these. So I found these at the mall in a town over from us at this like chocolate factory and he is obsessed. <gasps> Are these your favorite treats, Mello? These are your favorite treats, aren't they? I know they are. Oh my goodness, Mello loves these treats. Okay, I'm gonna give him one of these right now. Lay down. Good boy, baby. Oh my goodness. You like that, don't you? You really, really like that. Okay, so that is all of Mello's gifts. So honestly, I would have gotten him way more and way more toys and stuff. But the thing is, is that every time I go out to Target or TJ Maxx or a store like that, I always pick him up something. So he has way too many toys right now. Way too many. Mommy spoils him. Um... Yeah, he's a little spoiled, but. All right, you guys, so it is now time to do a quick unboxing of my gifts. Now, I would just like to say these are two very big purchases that I typically do not do. I am not someone that spends my money on designer items or luxury items. I'm a serial saver, so most of my money does go into my savings account if it's like extra money. And I also invest a lot of it. So typically if I do invest my money, it goes into stocks and crypto and that sort of thing. I try to keep a very healthy portfolio of investments, but I did decide to invest into a few 
items just to kind of treat myself splurge on myself you know so i think i'm gonna do gucci first and i am very excited about both of these purchases a lot of thought went into them i am not someone that just makes impulse purchases because i don't typically regret my purchases but sometimes i'm like eh, i could have spent my money a little bit smarter and i don't like that feeling so i do try to be very you know okay so we have our dust bag a little gucci dust bag and then let's Oh, I'm so excited, you guys. I am so excited about this item. Oh, no. Okay. So they're actually the wrong item. Oh, my gosh. I was so excited. Okay, so let me just unbag this. But, okay, so here they are. I mean, these are gorgeous, don't get me wrong. I got this exact shoe just in a different pattern. So the shoes that I was supposed to get are these right here. I'm gonna pop them up on the screen. Um, and for how much money I spent on these shoes, I, I should have got the right one. Let's try them on. Ooh, okay, so there are them on. I mean, oh my gosh, these are gorgeous. Like, don't get me wrong, but I did not get these shoes. I wanted the other pattern. Okay, so these actually did not come directly from the Gucci website. They did have these in stock on the Gucci website, but they didn't have the pattern that I wanted in stock. So I ended up getting these from Netta Porter. Okay, so just showing you guys my order confirmation. So as y'all can see, I did order these ones, which are a lot different. So box is tied back up. These are unfortunately Unfortunately, going back definitely not keeping those hopefully we'll have <laughs> more luck with this box so this did come directly from the Dior website so I'm imagining they did send me the right product let's go ahead and unbox this one I love this bow this bow is super cute let's see if I can untie it oh, oh my gosh okay this I'm really excited about out of the two purchases I was most excited about the Dior Dior is probably my most favorite designer brand if I had to choose out of them and these are also shoes so we have our little Dior dust bag then a little Dior card Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm so excited about these. Oh, I really hope these fit. I really hope these fit. I actually got a 36.5 in both of these shoes, which equates to a six and a half. I'm usually a six, but um, I looked up reviews for this and people were saying that they run pretty true to size. And I do have a six and a half in a lot of my shoes like this. So I'm hoping they fit. Oh my gosh, these are gorgeous. Okay, so here they are. Let me take this little thing off. I have no clue how I'm going to like these, but I absolutely love this style of shoe. I've never seen anybody with these. I've never seen anybody talk about these. Like I said, I did look up a review on these just to like get a feel for it and see how the sizing runs. But I love this style of sandal. I think they are so gorgeous. Okay, let me put them on. Yes. Okay, there's them on. Let me put both of them on so y'all can get the full. Okay, I'm going to leave that on just in case. Just in case. And they just have Velcro straps that you just take off. I love the little Dior right there. So stinking cute. Okay, so here are the shoes on. Ignore my feet. I really need to get them done. I'm just super lacy. But oh my gosh, I love, love, love these. Okay, let's try to walk in them and see if they're comfortable. Ooh, okay, yes. <gasps> Oh my gosh. Okay, so here they are without the little tag on them. I will say they're super noisy. Like, listen. <laughs> they're super noisy. I don't know if that will go away or if I should wear socks with them. I'm not sure. But I do love them. I'm definitely keeping these. And then the Gucci platforms are unfortunately gonna have to go back. But let me get Mello and we will say goodbye to you guys. Mello, you wanna say bye bye? <gasps> Oh, are you playing with your cake? Okay, look at this mess. I gotta clean that up. Okay, Bubby, say bye. Say bye-bye.
let me lay down with you all right you guys well i hope y'all enjoyed this birthday vlog he loves laying on top of me like me and gabe he'll just get on top of us and lay down all right you guys i love y'all so 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 much please drop a thumbs up down below if you enjoyed it and i will see you guys in the next video bye guys